it going, everybody? Urbanonic72 here. And I hope you guys haven't missed me, obviously. But uh, school started for me, high school and college. I do a, a program where I can do both of those, so I'm, I'm keeping extra busy. Hope you guys have been well. Um, today I'm going to show you guys how to do the new 1.8 Zombies Flying Mod Pack update um, and installation for Minecraft on a Macintosh. So, um, on my tutorials, I like to keep them simple, straightforward, and help you guys get through them as fast as possible. So, I'm going to adhere to that, and let's get started. What you guys want to do first is you want to go to this link, which will be in the description, as always. It's on minecraftforum.net. And then you're going to have zombie mod pack here, and you're going to have a list of mods you can use in single player, and then what you can use in single player and multiplayer. So these work in both, these just work in single player. But don't get me wrong, like these work in that too, so don't get confused there. Single player, everything works. So what you want to do is you want to go to current uh, version 4.37, and this works for, as it says, 1.8 and 1.81. You're going to want to hit download link. And as you guys can see, I've downloaded the zombie mod kit pack before, so um, it's already there, obviously. Um, we can exit out of Chrome for the moment. I don't think we need that. So what you guys want to do is you want to just go ahead and hit the unzip. So as you can see, like I said, I've got it already done here. And then, whoops. No. Okay, so. We've got the uh, Zombies mod pack here. What you guys want to do now is you want to go into, or you want to um, take the code out of the description. These two, both both these codes will be in the description, by the way, but um, they're here for me right now. So if when you guys are at the point where you need these codes, just copy and paste them out of the description box below. So you're going to copy this first one. Uh, push Command, Space Bar. Type in Terminal. I've already done it. Terminal's going to pop up. You're going to hit that. You want to paste that this code over here into terminal so push command V now enter make sure you push enter we're done with that for the moment what you're going to want to do now is you're going to want to go back to um, finder and you're going to want to open the zombies mod pack but push command N so get a new um, <laughs> window going on here I'm going to minimize that so you guys can see what I'm doing. So you're going to want to type in MCTMP, like usual. You're going to have classes. Go back to Zombies Mod Pack, Classes, Command A, Highlights All, Command C, Copy. Go in here, just click on any of them. Command V, Paste. Apply to all so you're replacing all the ones that you need to. Push Replace. Now you can close out of MCTMP. And then go back to the codes in the description and copy the second code box area, the second group right here. Command C, go into terminal and push Command V, paste it in. Make sure you push Enter, and then you can just quit out of terminal. Uh, what that does, guys, is that basically um, take or gets rid of MC TMP. You don't want that um, there. Um, because if it's, you know, if you don't get rid of it, it's not going to function properly. So, you know, this is the one that makes it. This is the one that gets rid of it. So you've got, like, CDM, assuming, like, create or something, RM, remove. Um, so it's pretty simple there. Uh, you guys uh, will not be needing those codes anymore throughout the video, so I'm going to go ahead and quit out of that. You're going to want to go back to the Zombies Mod Pack, this general area. What you want to do now is you want to hit Config, <clears throat> and then you're going to want to hit another new window. So now go to your name with a little house button, library, application support, Minecraft. Now what you want to do is you want to go to, uh, you want to create a folder named mods. Uh, mine's already there because I have um, the Yogbox installed. Uh, I have another video showing how to do that if you guys are interested in using the Yogbox mods, which are mostly single player. But so once you get a Folder called mods, just like this, M-O-D-S, nothing else. Open it. As you can see, I've got a lot of other ones in here. But that doesn't matter. All you guys need to do is go up here and push create new folder. You want to name this one Z-O-M-B-E. And you have to spell it that way or it will not function properly. Enter. So now you've just got this empty 
you know, folder called zombie. What you want to do now is you want to do the same thing that you did with the classes. Highlight them all with Command-A and then copy them with Command-C. Go in here, zombie, the zombie folder that you made. Push Command-V and paste them all in. Now you can close out of the zombie mod pack um, window. And now you just have the application support Minecraft one. Click config.txt. And it's going to show this little message saying you got this from the internet. It's okay. And then scroll down. And it's right about here, as you can see on the right-hand side, on the menu bar. Just to help you out. And then you're going to find flying. What you want to do is you want to take care of that little pound sign and just delete it. That's how you would enable any mod on here. If you want to go up and do this one, do the one right there, right before where it says mod. And then something enabled. So fly enabled. So then you've got your general buttons. You've got F to turn it on, E to fly up, Q to go down, and then you can put in numbers here to change how fast your character will move. While you're walking, you can push shift to change your walking speed. So once you guys, once you have um, deleted this, push uh, or save it, command S, and then you can quit out of it. You must save it or it will not work properly. So as we're coming to the end here, we're getting to Minecraft, open up your launcher and log in. As you can see, those mods are changing how my um, game functions. But this works in single player, multiplayer, like I said. I'm just doing single player because it's a little faster. What you guys might want to do is you might want to change your controls around because F is usually uh, allocated to another control. So just um, change it so F is completely open. Push F. And voila, everybody. You are now flying in Minecraft 1.8 through Zombies Mod Pack, the 1.8 update. Now, I hope you guys have enjoyed my video. Please uh, leave a rating, um, a comment, a, um, you know, subscribe if you guys really enjoyed the video. Um, I love to have more subscribers because it lets me connect with more people. And, um, you know, that's what keeps me going, being able to make videos for you guys. So if you enjoyed it, uh, please, you know, thumbs up or thumbs down. And if you guys would like to see any other um, tutorials, uh, please uh, shoot me off a message. And by the way, thanks for 100 subscribers, everybody. And I'll be uh, talking to you guys later. Thanks. Peace out.